Hi guys, in this video I want to show a very interesting repair method. If you couldn't find the part of the power supply, we can use an external power supply to start our board. Let's watch the video. In the third part of this repair, after searching the datasheet of two of the parts, I unfortunately did not find anything. So I had to use the shortcut method to repair the board of the radiography machine. As you can see, there are two pieces of TBS diode that I couldn't find information about and I couldn't get them from the market. Their names are GP528 and that one is C405. Therefore, I checked the part of the board that was damaged and found that one of the TVS diodes is located in one of the outputs of the producing transformer. So I removed the 50 volts capacitor after the rectifier bridge. And I separated the output path of the trans using a cutter and so that it leads the input of ICL M317S. After checking the datasheet of this IC, I realized that its input voltage can vary from 3.3 volts to 33 volts. Now, using an external power source, I gave a voltage of 10 volts to the input of the LM317S to see how the behavior of this IC would be in the input. And by increasing the voltage to 18 volts, I realized that the output of the LM317 is fixed at 12 volts. When I realized that the minimum voltage that I can apply so that there is no problem is 18 volts. That's why I started the device using an 18 volts solar supply with an amps in the input path of the LM317S. I didn't have the problem of not funding the parts anymore. Next, I will install the 18 volts power supply on the board. Let's see the steps to continue the work together to get acquainted with the details of the repair work. I soldered the power output to the IC input. Now I'm soldering the power input wires to the power supply.
Now I will solder the power input to the input power of the board. Now I used hot glue to stick the power supply to the board. Here I connected the board to the CT electricity using a test lamp and we can see that the LEDs of the board light up and the device works. I would be happy if you follow me and subscribe. Good luck.